Hi, I'm Carrie Escobedo. I'm the director of EIT Business Solutions at T-Mobile. T-Mobile is one of the largest players in the wireless space in the U.S. We've got about 42,000 employees. We operate nationwide as well as in Puerto Rico. We have really a goal of providing the latest technology around wireless, both at an affordable and easy to use perspective for our customers. And we meet this goal by offering the largest 4G network, by having a portfolio of affordable smartphones, by having our brand be recognized from a customer service perspective. I service multiple customers, so HR, finance, our enterprise commission team, as well as our enterprise content management. So I get beat up about three specific things. Speed to market, how long does it take to stand something up? How late is the data? So how long does it take us to stage this information from multiple disparate sources? And the last thing is always the UI. It's ugly there, or anything out there. It's not user friendly and it takes a lot of training to be able to, to get them up to speed and have them be self-sufficient. In thinking about some of the things that, that challenge T-Mobile in its very competitive, fast-paced environment, pulling data from all these different places and, and running things that took a very long time to set up, one and to actually execute and then if we wanted to change something we had to start all over. T-Mobile is very interested in SAP strategic workforce planning application on the HANA technology platform for a couple of reasons. The technology allows us to, to do um, real-time reporting, real-time analytics. Um, the strategic workforce planning application itself is an out-of-the-box application that gives us a good jump start and we don't have to build many of those things um, on specific to T-Mobile that aren't really special for us from an HR perspective, from, from a workforce planning perspective. I see the SAP HANA technology um, offering a big value to T-Mobile because it allows us to really take advantage of the data that's coming in real time from our stores, from our sales systems, um, our billing systems, and really make real time decisions off of that. So the speeds that we see coming out of the SAP HANA technology really take a lot of the pressure off my business folks to really understand perfectly what they want when they're sitting down the first time. One of the things that we noticed when we started participating in the SAP Strategic Workforce Planning pilot, something that took us about a month to set up the first time, we did, we did it in about three hours. One of our scenarios um, ended up being something like 66 million calculations and it returned the results within a second. So we were able to take a look at the results, change a few things in the scenario, run it again, and it returned it just as fast. That gives us a lot of power in the hands of our generalists, in the hands of directors in HR to be able to you know, try something out, get it back. Try something else out because it wasn't quite what they want, get it back all in the same time frame. In the past, we would have done that, submitted a query, got our results, oh darn, it's not quite what we want. Um, probably another couple of days, we'll get the query back. Who knows when we get the query back? Um, and keep trying in um, trial and error. I see the SAP HANA technology um, offering a big value to T-Mobile because it allows us to really take advantage of the data that's coming in real time from our stores, from our sales systems, um, our billing systems, and really make real time decisions off of that. It's amazing how fast it is in the hands of my business folks. I'm Carrie Escobedo and I'm the Director of Business Solutions and Enterprise IT at T-Mobile and I run SAP.